We're gonna bring in two of the most wickedest producer DJs from England. See? Alongside the Rockman MC. Hailing from the UK district of Bristol. Will you please make some noise tonight inside for DJ Ronnie Size and Yeah, wicked out there, man. So trust me, this is definitely the big one. Big enough only for this one. Respect for the side effects, the MC that I'm the navigator for taking it through properly, confidently. Okay, time for the full cycle crew to take over. Are you ready for the sounds, my son? So what do you think of what do you think of the whole scene here in Germany? It's mad, isn't it? Yeah, it's kicking off, man. Yeah. It's good. A couple of years ago it was really quiet and small, but now, you know what I mean, all the DJs from England are coming here, so it's picking up. It's good. Taking over the world. Taking over the world, they really are. So they say. But we'll see what happens, you know what I mean? It's early days yet. You know what I mean? This music's still a baby and we've got, we've got a long way to go. Yeah. A lot of new, new new things are gonna happen. You know, next year is gonna be the year when you know, a lot of the small labels have set up their foundations now and they're going to be ready to take on the world. So, you know, take over the world, I don't know, but maybe take on the world, you know what I mean? See what happens. A good portion of it, anyhow. Definitely, man. We're, we're, you know, we're doing our bit, man. We're, we're in Europe, we're, you know, in the States, and we're putting out music on a regular basis, you know what I mean? So, we're doing our piece for the scene, and it's just good to be here with everyone in the house. It's just... It's just Proper, like what's that what you say, man? So, so you guys, do you always work together? You do stuff for fee recordings and stuff. Do you always work together as a team or? Yeah, man, we're a family, yeah. full cycle family. We work together as a team. Yeah. It's not about one person, it's about all of us coming together yeah. and just making the music and presenting it. Yeah. And all of them, everything. So, so what about what about the album? The album that you're gonna do, album, that everyone's waiting yeah, for. I mean, is that again all you guys together, or that's just yeah, that's it's, your? You know, it's just it's gonna be, it's gonna come when it comes. It's gonna come when it's ready. It's got to be ready. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's, it's a statement of how we're living. Yeah. So it's got to be ready, and it is ready now. And I've got TPs in my bag, so you know I can give those out later on and stuff. But you know, it's really happening. It's, it's really, I don't know, man. You just, you know, what I mean, tickled my tongue. Yeah. You know? But yeah, look forward for that, man. Look forward to that. So what, what else should we look forward to? What else is all going to happen? Well, we've got, um, uh, uh, we've got another subsidiary label called um, Dope Dragon. We're doing an album for that. Um, there's a V album coming up. Um, a genetic in the manipulation EP on Full Cycle. Various projects by DJ Dai, Scorpio. Um, basically, we're just up in, up in the whole project, stepping up a gear, trying to... We're trying to create acts now. What we're trying to do is create some acts. Rather than, you know what I mean, start a record label, we, we're going to create acts. We've got a lot of acts, a lot of singers, vocalists. You know, so it's not just a, a record label just putting out records. It's going to be, you know what I mean, a company building acts yeah. to take all over the world. You know what I mean? Because we, we're all over the world all the time. Like, me and Chris we, 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 we've, and Dynamite, we've done Europe. No, it's our second time around Europe for all those who know, all the people that's been following us. Just want to say thanks, you know what I mean? And keep following us, whatever. You know what I mean? I'm sure just, they will. Yeah, got just, you know, just I want to see all those faces. I've been seeing everywhere I've been going. I want to see those faces there at the front. You know the ones. So, so what do you guys think? Because, you know, I remember, you know, a few years ago, it was always really hard to get people from the whole drum and bass jungle scene to get them on the show because a lot of people were very wary of media. They were so scared that media were kind of going to ruin the scene and stuff. 
uh, what do you think? I mean, because the media, we didn't stop. Everyone was still on top of it. What do you think now? I mean, do you think it's actually killed the scene? No, the, no. the, the scene's been there and it always will be there. There yeah. are obvious sides to it, you know, which the media will pick up on. But, you know, it's like any business, you know, they try and make it mainstream and try and make a profit out of it. But the scene will survive, you know, the scene's been there, it's been through many changes. And it will, you know what I mean, keep changing and... And just you know, do what it does best, and just carry on. It will be an uh, underground scene. Is underground. You get yeah. me. Fractions of it will go off and do other parts, but the the, the main part of the yeah. scene is there where it's at. It also seems to be such a unity between you know all the artists. Also, there, I don't know. It's just much more than on other scenes than on the house, you know, whatever. It seems much more like people really stick yeah, together well, and back is, each other up. Because this is something that this is the music that we had to fight for. Yeah. You understand? People told us it was wrong, but we didn't listen to them. We just carried on doing our thing until. You know, we got to a stage where, you know what I mean, it became something and it's proud to be part of that family. You've got to remember this music is, is, baby, is a baby. It took hip-hop 10 years to break. Yeah. You know what I mean, we're in our third, fourth year, you know, and, you know, nothing's really happened yet. And look what's happening here, you know what I mean? The buzz is here and nothing's really happened yet, you know what I mean? So we'll see what happens. Yeah. That's all I can say is let's see what happens, you know what I mean? Well, I think the future looks quite bright. All right, anyway, listen. Can we go and play a video for you guys or anything that you know that um, you'd like to see? Um. That you know we've got a video for? Seeing as we're from the West Country, representing all the Bristol people, man, we're going to go with a massive attack, Karma Coma, because that's kind of weird.